Welcome back to Daytime Ottawa, back to reintroduce you. So I think it's been about three years since Sophia was last on the show. She's an actor, she's a singer, songwriter, fabulous performer, and we're so lucky to have her back on the show to catch up. Sophia, welcome back to the show. Hi, Thank you. Great I mean, to have you. You've been busy. Yeah. You've been extremely busy. I know. You stepped away from acting to concentrate on music. So tell us, what have you been up to for the last couple of years? Well, I've been in the UK recording my albums. So my first one came out September 1st, 2014 in Toxic and now I'm about to release um, Beautiful Sin, which is going to be in late 2015, and I'm really excited, but um, I would have come back earlier, but I've been in the UK, so I can... What were you doing in the UK? Yeah. What brought oh, you there? I, I was recording, and okay. I, was, um, I was helping out with... Um, I'm co-owner in a company over there, so oh, a record okay. label. So it oh, just nice. made sense to go over there, and I had a really great time. And now I'm back in Canada, really enjoying the weather. <laughs> so <laughs> I know, we've been very spoiled with the weather, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah really well. Tell me what you were doing at 17. What was I doing at 17? <laughs> Playing a whole bunch of sports. It wasn't starting a company in a record label, that is for sure. I was doing less than you yes. at 17. <laughs> I wasn't even playing sports, I don't think. But even to that, I understand you're doing some great lessons with uh, Mr. Drover. Yeah, Glenn Drover, um, formerly Omega Death. He's um, co-producing my album with me, so I'm co-producer on it. So yeah, it's, it's going really well. I'm so happy, and I really respect Glenn. So. That's awesome. So how do you get? Where do you get your inspiration from? Where do you find, you know, your your muse to your music? That's a really tough question. I really love writing about love and hate passion, romance, all that stuff. And I like um, writing about everyday things that happen in everyday lives. And it's just really wonderful. And I think my favorite uh, thing about the music industry is the songwriting process. Right. I really love yeah, songwriting. Really it, it just makes me feel whole and uh, I don't stop, so yeah. So how would you describe the sound of the album to people? It's very eclectic. Okay. There's, um, there's a lot of like rock, alternative rock, and there's jazz and soul and R&B there's a lot actually and I love soft rock mainly soft rock alternative rock yeah so do you find that you you fit in a particular genre or do you like to have every aspect and touch on everything I like diversity so I like every aspect and that's what I'm, I'm working on right now and Sean Drover he's the drummer he's uh he's the drummer on my uh, album oh, as cool. well Woo! Oh, yeah, Sean. That. <laughs> and, um, yeah it's going really well with that and he suggested that I add diversity so I've been writing and uh, just trying to you know improve as a musician and as a person now you got to tell everybody I'm thoroughly impressed with this piece of information. How many songs have you written at your tender age of 17? <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> that's a really good question. <laughs> um, probably about 130 now. Wow. Again, what were you doing at 17? Uh, listen, you know, I can't, I can't say. It, it, it might get me in too much trouble. You have a music video coming out too, right? In yeah. the fall. Oh, How, yeah. That must have been a lot of fun to work on. Oh, yeah. It was a really relaxing day. Beautiful weather, except near the end. Uh, but um, it was a really relaxing day of fun. But it was professional. And uh, we were really on the ball. So we got everything done. Good for the, you. Yeah, it was really awesome. And I did that with Say 10 Productions, a really wonderful film photography company. And thank you so much, Derek Price, for that. Yeah. Excellent. Th yeah, thanks a lot, Derek. Yeah. Uh, you're going to be performing <laughs> a song for us today on the show. What song are you performing? I'm performing Saint or Sinner. And it's a song, actually, I wrote in... Um, actually, I, I thought of this song, of writing this song in a bathroom stall. Okay. <laughs> I don't need to hear any more, Sophia. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. Hey, I'm a rocker, man. <laughs> they can get it from anywhere. Exactly. Well, anywhere. we're going to step aside and let you take it away. Ladies and gentlemen, Sophia Radish here on Daytime. Thank you so much. I'm a sinner, I'm a saint, I'm a sinner 
I'll follow you another day It's hard to think about I'm a saint I'm a sinner I'm a saint I'm a sinner I'll follow you another day It's hard to think about I'm out of reach I'll follow you to feel alive See me through See me It's hard to save a life when it is your own. I'm a saint, I'm a sinner, I'm a saint, I'm a sinner. I'll follow you another day. It's hard to think about. I'm a saint, I'm a sinner, I'm a saint, I'm a sinner. I'll follow you another day. It's hard. I'm a saint, I'm a sinner, I'm a saint, I'm a sinner. I'll follow you another day It's hard to think about I'm a saint I'm a sinner I'm a saint I'm a sinner I'll follow you another way It's hard to think about I'm a saint I'm a sinner I'm out of reach I'm a saint I'm a sinner It's hard to leave I'm a saint I'm a sinner